What's going on, y'all? This is your 80s music lover. Lover! Today is February the 20th, 2020. And I'm showing these two CD box sets and CD and a box set of prints. Of course, you see the Rainbow Children there. That's the CD. CD. And you see One Night Alone. Okay? Live. Prince, the man. And that's the box set. Alright? Now, I want to talk about these two. Uh, you know, classics here. Um, I just went on the Prince Official Store website. And, lo and behold, bam, actually they sent me a, um, a message, because I'm, you know, su subscribed to them to get anything that pops up, you know, right away, and shoot me the, the news, so I can share it with you guys, and keep up to date with the uh, Prince Estate and what's going on in the, the Prince store and everything. So, what I come to find is, the Rainbow Children is going to be reissued or re-released on purple, I'm sorry, no, on clear colored vinyl. It's going to be two vinyl disc, and they're going to be both clear, like clear shower liner clear, you know, that glass looking clear, with the um, label, the Rainbow Children labels, um, of the kids, and then one, I think the second LP is the one of Prince when he's on the album cover, when his hand, like, he's, like, half of him is shown, like he's half hiding, and the other half he's holding the other side of the wall, balancing, holding the wall, you know, standing there. So, that's that, and that is going to cost 40 bucks, $39.98 for those two. They're also going to be re-releasing the CD of the Rainbow Children. Um, I don't believe there's going to be anything special as far as the packing is concerned. I think it's going to be, I believe it's going to be the same way this, the original CD, what you're looking at here, um, was put out. Because they're not, they're not using, um, what do you call it, the, uh, the plastic you know, casings anymore. They're putting them in these flip-out material, you know, uh, that for picture material. You could just flip it out, cardboard type of thing with the shine to it. And that's how the Rainbow Children came out anyway. This the original. So I don't believe there's not going to be much done. They're probably going to have a hype sticker stating that from the Prince of State and updated things and stuff like that, reissue after so many years, blah, blah, blah. But that's all you're going to get. It's going to be exactly the same as what you're seeing right here on that. Okay. But I'm most excited about the two clear vinyl disc set that is going to come in on a record. I have the original um, Rainbow Children on vinyl. The two black vinyl. And the booklet. Now, I'm not sure if this is going to come with the booklet. Like the original album, the vinyl album does, because I have it. Um, but one thing that we're going to get, I hope we get the booklet, because it's a nice color, you know, a pretty thick booklet, you know, that came with it. I like the way it was packed. I hope we get it. I hope we do. It's going to be pressed on 150 gram, all right? But what we will get is a slipcover vinyl mat. It's going to be a Rainbow Children's Limited Edition slip cover that you put on your your turntable and you put your record on there to protect it it's going to be look nice it's going to be like a rainbow color like red gold yellow green aqua blue blue swirled around and like diamond shapes with the uh, prince emblem that unpronounceable em emblem his emblem the symbol the love symbol it's going to be that in the center so that's, we're going to get that with this Rainbow Children 2 uh, CD, I'm excuse me, keep saying CD, 2 clear vinyls set. Alright? 
Now that's that. Now the CD is going to cost ten bucks. All right, CD is going to be just be nine ninety nine. It's not going to be that much from from the website. That's what I believe. Let me double check. No, nine ninety eight. Just the re-release of the CD, nothing special. All right, same thing. If you have it, then no big deal. Like I have, I'm not gonna get it. That, and I'm not gonna get the CD because I have it right here. I have the original, perfect condition. Okay, no need for me to get it again just because it says what 2020, the Prince Estate. I don't, <laughs> I don't need. But I, what I do need is that vinyl because it's being the first time being pressed on clear colored vinyl. And being reissued, that's a great album to have on vinyl. As you can see, you can look it up on eBay. See how much that daggum thing costs. Look at it. Man, that daggum thing costs going for like, what, six, six to $800? $500? $600? I've seen it as much as uh, almost 1000 I've seen it just as that much. All right, I don't know, matter if it's sealed or unsealed. That's a rare rarity to be a collectible on vinyl because there's not, there wasn't too many versions, I mean, there wasn't too many copies pressed of the Rainbow Children. All right, and Prince had just got his name back coming from out of that era from, you know, the unpronounceable symbol, love symbol of the uh, artist formerly known, formerly known as Prince. He went and got his legal name back, his his name Prince back, so this was the first album where his name appeared legally after the unpronounceable symbol. So there was a kind of a pre-emancipation for him, you know, or and maybe this at one, you know, so that was nice to see too. So um, now let's move over to One Night Alone, all right? Let's talk about that. Let's talk about that. All right, let's see what's happening here. All right, that's the book. I said this is this is what this is when I got this when it came out back in the day. All right, now that's the CD right there, and <clears throat> there the Prince Estate is going to release a four LP vinyl purple vinyl set. I know we're getting purple again. Purple vinyl set of this album, this live recorded One Night Alone album by Prince. In 150 gram. All right, that's thick, and it's gonna cost us sixty-nine dollars and ninety-eight cents, basically seventy bucks. All right, so that's cool. Now, what I was a little bit like, okay, why didn't they just put this together as they did here? This is one set. They gave you both of these CDs, right? The it ain't over has nine tracks on it. And this, these nine tracks on this song, when I when they say it ain't over in an after party, Prince wasn't playing. It's almost better than this one here with, I don't know how many, what the, there's two CDs in here. It's a long, right? He swore the, the crowd and everything. Look at all these daggum songs, y'all. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. See that? That's a lot of music. It's live, okay? But I'll say that It Ain't Over has nine tracks. All right? And it's banging. All these nine tracks are banging. They're like long, full songs almost, and he's getting down. I love the Dorothy Parkey, uh, <laughs> excuse me, y'all, Dorothy Parker cover on this. All right, banging. I love how he gets the crowd in it, and they just was Dorothy Parker, Dorothy Parker. It was tight, and I was like, woo hoo hoo! Dang, this almost can be a. It ain't nothing better. I mean, it's not gonna outdo the original from Sign of the Times. I love Dor Dorothy Parker, the original song on it, but it is a very, very another alternative version. If you want to just listen to something else live, I believe it's his best live performance of Dorothy Parker because how he does it, you just got to hear it. It's just off the chains. Now, this is what that that's this is what you have. But what they're doing, the Prince State, is they broke this up. They're selling it 
separately. They're selling the album It Ain't Over, right? The, uh, One Night Alone, the after show, It Ain't Over, with Prince and the MPG, as a separate entity item. They're selling it on, and they're, they're, this is how they're packing it. 2LP purple, 150 gram vinyl disc for $31.98 for this on vinyl. Separate. It doesn't come with it. This is, you would think it would come with this. They could have added on, you know, made it a 6 LP. But I don't know how they felt they would have priced it. So they said, let's separate it. And I would say, the only thing I say that's good about it is this, this after party show thing is banging. It's banging. It's almost better than this. Almost. And them nine songs was kicking, boy. So... It's worth it. I'll say it's worth it. Uh, now, here's something else. They have this One Night Alone at one LP on purple vinyl on pressed on 150 gram. And it's $25.98. Now, this item here is very, it's very unique. And I, I was a little bit like, what is this? I'm a little, I was a little intrigued by it. It only has a total of 10 songs, okay? 10 songs. Four on side A and six on side B, all right? I'll, I'll tell you the tracks on here that are not found except for One Night Alone on these, okay? They're not on these, all right? And the tracks go like this as listed, side A, One Night Alone. You're going to see me. I think you're going to see me might be on One Night Alone. It might not. Uh, Here on Earth. A Case of You. Okay. Joni Mitchell. He's one of Prince's idols. All right. Um, and then that's side A. Side B. Have a Heart. Objects in the Mirror. Avalanche. Pearls Before the Swine. Young and Beautiful. And the last track was the sixth track. On side B is Ar Arboretum, Arbor or 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 Arboretum or Arboretum, Boretum, Arboretum. If I'm not pronouncing that right, you guys, you know, I don't know. <laughs> That's Arboretum or Arbor Arboretum. So, um, that's it, and that's sold separately, and I gave you the price for that one. That's $25.98 for that one. So, we got a lot of stuff going on here. And then that's not it. Also with this, you have a super deluxe CD collection. Okay. It's called Up All Night with Prince. The One Night Alone Collection 4 CD 1 DVD set. Alright. This thing costs... $38.98, basically 40 bucks, right? And this thing has, like I said, two, uh, three CDs, right? Is that what it said? Three? Oh, it says four CDs. Four CDs. <clears throat> all right. It said, all right, these are the CDs. Disc one. Is One Night Alone, Solo Piano, and Voice by Prince. Okay, that's the one that I was telling you about that was a standalone. And it has uh, A Case of You on it. And a lot of songs, like mostly, like all of them, are not featured on neither one of these. Okay? That's live. I wish they would sell that separate, but they don't. Um, and then this too is One Night Alone Live, which we are all familiar with here. Okay? This, this three, oh wait, hold on, hold on, how did I miss this? Okay, this uh, two and three are one night alone live, because there's two discs in this, okay? And then the fourth disc is one night alone, the after show, it ain't over. So you're getting these, except you're getting the one with uh, the Joni Mitchell song, Case of You, that he covers, right? And the other songs I never heard of before, and they weren't played on these. So that's the tempt temptation of how they're going to get you to get that CD because you know, you're missing that one piece of them 10 songs. 
all right, with the exception of One, uh, one Night Alone and maybe one other song, all right? Then you have the disc uh, 5, which is the DVD of this Super Deluxe disc uh, set. It comes, the DVD comes with it, one DVD, and it's just Prince Live at the Aladdin in Las Vegas, okay? So I have that already. I have that already on the side, as in with my Prince concerts and stuff, I have the, the, uh, the um, Live at the Aladdin, Las Vegas. I have that. It's a good concert, you know? Not one of my favorites, but it's a decent, good concert. That's when Prince really started to tone things down. I believe he had already committed to being a Jehovah's Witness, and he, was, he had transitioned some. The way he was dressing, you know, was more clean, suit-like, but Prince style. Prince can never be commercial, y'all. He always has something going on with he changes it up and makes it sexier than sexy. You know what I'm saying? But it was very respectable. So uh, he wasn't, he stopped, he had stopped doing the splits around his time. And like, you know, <clears throat> this was way before we even knew he had any pelvic pains and, and things going on. He was taking medication for that stuff. Nobody knew anything about what he was going, what was going on. But Prince was not doing the splits back then. Okay, he, I don't know, hey, and Prince matured more. No, Prince, cause if Prince could have done the splits, he would have been doing them till he was 99 years old. If Prince could have, if he'd have lived that long, he would have been doing the splits, right? But he couldn't do them, and we just didn't know why he wasn't. Well, Prince is Prince. He didn't have to do the splits. Prince sang, he played the guitar, Prince looked pretty, you know, and he did his thing. We didn't need him to do the splits to have a complete concert. We didn't care. But around this time, if you notice, if you look at that, if you have that one, look at it. He does not do the splits, ever, in that concert. Because the doctor said, oh, ho, ho. stop doing the splits. Uh, take no splits, no dancing like that, and, call, and then call me in the morning. <laughs> Cut it out. Slow down. All right? So, you know, this is what was going on. So... Um, just letting y'all know, that's about the gist of it. That's the end of all the the um, the Rainbow Children and the One Night Alone Live with Prince. That we're getting, these are the next two projects that's going to be released on vinyl and in sets. And the, the release date, y'all, is right around the corner. March 25th this year. Get it? March 25th of this year. That's right around the corner. Like I said, today is February the 20th. So look it, okay? So get your pocketbooks ready. It's time to get broke again. <laughs> and get this great music. Get these things, okay? Because it's going down. Prince State said, hey, it's time we're going to start livening it up here. We was quiet for a minute, all right? <laughs> You know, with the last release, you know, the uh, 1999 wore everybody's tails out. I know it wore my tail out. Y'all see my videos. Well, I was going crazy buying all the 1999. Love 1999. But my gosh, it turned my pockets upside down, y'all. It took my, my milk money from the future. <laughs> the Princess State bullied me ten times over. <laughs> I said, where's the bully at from elementary? He was nicer. <laughs> but anyway, uh, yeah, I just want to hit y'all on the hip with that and let y'all know it's coming. All right, these two right here is going to be released on vinyl, purple vinyl, except this one, thank God, it's not going to be perfect. It's going to be two clear vinyl disc. Woo! Lord, I would have been happy if they would have made one out alone clear. I am so tired of the purple vinyl. It looks beautiful, but my gosh. We are overwhelmed with it by now. We have enough purple. Prince was more than purple. I got to keep saying it. Prince Estate, if you're looking at YouTube videos, please listen. Enough with the purple. I appreciate it, okay? No, I don't appreciate it. I appreciate it. But that's enough. <laughs> purple vinyl. Okay? Shoot. So, um, I'm going to close out saying peace out, y'all. You guys. You know, uh, get these pre-orders, um, continue to support uh, the Prince lovers of his music uh, and his legacy. Let's keep on supporting our boy and, and everything so we can keep getting this wonderful music 
on vinyl that has never been pressed on vinyl, which One Night Alone has never been pressed on vinyl, and that's great. And so, you know what I would like to see pressed on vinyl? And I'm going to end it with this. I would love to see um, 2010. You know, that. I would love to see that pressed on vinyl. That would be freaking off the hook. Right? Come on, y'all. Y'all know what's up. All right, y'all. Uh, this is 80s Music Lover signing out. Peace out. Yo, you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Leave your comments below. Don't get nasty. And it won't be no nasty thrown back at you, no. No, you guys say what you feel, you know. Uh, let's talk about it. Um, you know, and uh, yeah. So, uh, Purple Life, Purple Medley, Peace Be Wild, May You Live to See the Dawn, and all that great stuff. And uh, I'm out. Later.